very warm welcome to one and all. I am Rohini Bhatpal from Gokhale Education Society's JDC Bitko English Medium High School with Standard 8 Science subject. And the topic is Chapter Number Two: Health and Diseases. Can you recall, students? Have you ever taken the leave from school due to sickness? What happens exactly when we become sick? Sometimes we feel good even without taking any medicines and sometimes we need to consult doctor and take regular medicines in sickness. Why is it so? Students, health is a state of complete physical, mental and social well-beingness and not merely the absence of any disease. Then students, what is disease? Condition of disturbances in physiological or psychological processes of body is called as disease. Each disease has its own specific symptoms. Now let us see what are the types of diseases. You must have heard the names of various diseases like diabetes, common cold, asthma, Down syndrome, heart disease etc. Reasons and symptoms of all these diseases are different. To bring coordination in scientific study of diseases, diseases are classified as follows. According to duration and according to reasons. According to durations are chronic disease and acute disease. According to reasons are hereditary diseases, acquired diseases. Hereditary diseases means Down syndrome. Again, acquired diseases have their own two types, infectious diseases and non-infectious diseases. Students, can you tell? Read these three questions. Then let us see what is infectious diseases. Diseases spread through contaminated air, water, food or vectors that is insect and other animals are called as infectious diseases now students see this chart name of disease is given pathogen is given mode of infection is given symptoms is given and preventive and treatments are given in that first is tuberculosis second is hepatitis third is dysentery fourth is cholera and fifth is typhoid students go through this chart you have to draw this chart Observe and discuss students. Search the reasons, symptoms and other information of chickenpox. Collect additional information about pulse polio drive and WHO. See students, dirtness in the surrounding. Where do you see the waterlogged material shown in the picture? Which hazards do you anticipate with the help of a picture? Now let us move towards the first disease that is dengue. Mosquitoes lay the eggs in the waterlogged places and thereby their population increases. Different species of mosquitoes spread different diseases. Dengue is spread by Aedes aegypti. This disease is caused by Den 1 4 virus belonging to the type flavivirus. Let us see the symptoms acute fever, headache, and vomiting. Pain in eye socket is very prominent symptom and decrease in platelet count that may lead to internal hemorrhage. Observe and discuss students. Observe the picture shown in following and write description in the boxes. Collect information students which measures are taken for mosquito control by Gram Panchayat, Municipal Council and Municipality of your area. Do you know students? Malaria is caused due to female anophils while elephant diatiasis due to female culex. Anophils and edis grow in clean water while culex in dirty sewage water. Let us see the second disease, swine flu. Reasons of infection. Infection for swine flu occurs through pigs and humans. Viruses of swine flu are spread through sweat of infected person, similarly through secretion of nose, throat and saliva. Symptoms of swine flu are difficulty in breathing, second, sore throat and body pain. Now let us see diagnosis of swine flu. For diagnosis of swine flu, liquid from throat of patient is sent in laboratory. 
diagnostic facilities are available in National Institute of Virology, Pune and National Institute of Communicable Diseases, Delhi. Now see students, first case of swine flu was reported in Mexico in 2009. Swine flu is caused by the virus influenza A that is H1N1. Persons who come in contact with pigs can contact this disease. Let us move towards third disease that is AIDS. This disease is caused by HIV that is human immunodeficiency virus. In this disease, victims suffer from various diseases due to progressive weakening of natural immunity. Diagnosis of AIDS cannot be confirmed without test in medical laboratories. ELISA test is used for its proper diagnosis. Symptoms of AIDS are person specific. Always remember students, it does not occur due to touching and sharing of the food with HIV infected person. Our behavior with HIV infected person must be normal. Now do you know students, HIV was first reported in an Africa species of monkeys. According to the National AIDS Control Program, an on AIDS, 80 to 85 percent HIV infections in India occur through unsafe sexual contacts. Now, see students infections through animals. Rabies. This is a viral disease. It occurs due to the bite of the infected dog, rabbit, monkey, cat, etc. Virus enters the brain via neurons. Hydrophobia is one of the important symptoms of this disease. In this case, the victim shows extreme fear for water. Rabies is fatal disease. However, fatality can be prevented by timely vaccination before onset of symptoms. Let us see non-infectious diseases. Diseases which do not occur through infections and body contacts are called as non-infectious diseases. Such diseases arise in human body itself due to certain reasons. In that, first we will see what is a cancer. Uncontrolled and abnormal cell growth is called as cancer. Group or lump of cancerous cell is called as malignant tumor. Cancer can occur in various organs like lungs, mouth, tongue, stomach, breast, uterus, skin and tissues like blood. See the reasons. The reasons of cancer are consumption of tobacco, gutka, smoking, alcoholism, lack of fiber content that is fruits and leafy vegetables and food, excessive consumption of junk food like pizza and burger are some of the many possible reasons. Heredity may also be a reason. See the symptoms. Chronic cough, hoarse voice, difficulty in swallowing, incurable scar and inflammation, lumps in breast and unexplained weight loss. Always remember students, controlled diet helps to prevent some types of cancers. Let us see what is diabetes. The hormone insulin produced in pancreas controls the level of sugar glucose in blood. If insulin is secreted in low quantity, glucose level cannot be controlled. This disorder is called as diabetes. Let us see the symptoms. Frequent urination at night, increased obesity or weight loss and the reasons are heredity, obesity, lack of physical exercise and mental stress. Let us see. Preventive measures. Following the proper diet, medicines and exercise under the supervision of doctor help to keep the diabetes under control. Let us move towards heart diseases. Efficiency of the heart decreases due to decreased blood supply and thereby oxygen and nutrients supply to the heart muscles. Due to this heart has to perform more work that leads to stress on it. This may cause heart attack. If someone has heart attack, immediately consultation of doctor and treatment is necessary. See the symptoms. Severe chest pains, pains in shoulder, neck and arms, cramps in hand, uneasiness, tremors. Now see the reasons of heart attack. Smoking, alcoholism, diabetes, hypertension, obesity, 
lack of exercise heredity mental stress anger anxiety let us see misuse of medicines sometimes some people take the medicines without prescription of doctor overdose of medicines may affect our body example overdose of painkillers may damage nervous system excretion system liver overdose of antibiotic may leads to nausea stomach ache dysentery rash white patches on tongue etc let us see generic medicines generic medicines are also known as general medicines these are manufactured and distributed without any patent these medicines are at par in quality with branded medicines production cost of these medicines is very low due to fewer expenses on research as the formula is readily available let us see lifestyle and diseases students lifestyle includes the daily routine and the type of food nowadays habits like staying in bed till late morning and going to bed late in night frequent changes in meal timing lack of physical exercise consumption of junk food etc have been increased due to this such people are getting sick frequently if frequency of becoming sick is to be lowered people should follow right lifestyle it must include sufficient sleep right food yoga asanas pranayam and physical exercise physical exercise should also be as per one's own capacity vaccination is important to prevent many infectious diseases let us celebrate health awareness day 7th april world health day 29 september world heart day 14th june world blood donation day and last is 14th november world diabetes day students you have to go through blood donation students you have to write the question answers in your notebook you have to write difficult words and definitions 3 3 times each thank you students for listening see you again take care be safe at your home